Okay, let's go. Oh, oh, it's aborted. Damn. That was a bit quick. I don't think there's any point looking at analysis there, is there really?
Okay, let's see what we can do with the bullet again. Get some focus going here. Okay, let's attack. Well, defend the palm. Keep it simple. Okay, let's go here. Let's take familiar ground at the minute. Still familiar, so that's okay. And castle. It's all pretty straightforward at the moment, fairly comfortable. Comfortable doesn't mean that it's the best moves I'm making, it means I feel fairly comfortable with the position at the minute. So I'm not getting surprised with anything. Let's go here. So the issue is now this here, so I'm gonna go here first. Rook. Bishop. King. So 
a lot of backward movements. I'm trying it, I'm trying it. There's no definite win here at all. This is not a very good position for us, really. A long play game, the opponent would be able to defend against this. And we win on time. Hey, it's looking good, it's looking good. But really, it's not that good. Okay, so we'll just do it from... Yeah, all this is pretty normal stuff for me. And just coming here, bringing the bishop back, just waiting to see what the opponent's doing. Because the weak area really is, you know, this pawn here, because we don't have the knight supporting this pawn anymore. So we can't sort of like challenge through. Well, I suppose we could. You know, we could. You know, blast through, he takes, we take. But this, this pawn is going. So we'd have to jostle the bishop coming out somehow. And computer saying C5. I mean, this is where this it looks like a sort of stonewall thing. And um, really, I don't like that. You know, I'm not a fan of that sort of position because then his knight can sit here and be, you know, hold the center. That's why I don't like doing that. The computer saying that's the best move. That they're better than me. So obviously, it is right. It's just that I don't like that pattern, that picture. So we move the king, and it's minus something at the minute. Move our queen up, looking to attack the pawn. And it's same rook takes b4. Yeah, so could have taken the pawn here, but I'm thinking let's put some pressure towards the king. I have a go for a draw, or if the opponent loses themselves, maybe a win. And the washing's going crazy. Okay, so we captured. So only plus 0.5-ish, draw-ish, yep, there we go. So that's what we were aiming for, like the draw-ish sort of feel. They captured, we captured back. So it's a plus 0.2 for um, white at the moment, 0.4 now. So the queen moving does not give them a good thing. So knight g4 is what we played, and that's giving us the minus 4. In my head, I'm thinking, well, there's not much we can do. We can't really go here. Um, knight can take the bishop, making space around the king area. And I was thinking maybe coming here, maybe taking this um, pawn off. But that's away from the king, king activity. So it didn't feel as strong as it is, but it's over the two, minus two mark. So it is fairly devastating, it looks like. So the computer's saying move the bishop. And then it's saying rook e6, which is bringing this here to then start putting pressure towards the king. So that would have been quite nice. So that was a nice interesting bullet game. Okay, bullet practice again. Or not. So long pause and now they're moving fast. That makes me ask questions. Let's go here. And let's go. Oh, move it, move it. I lost tempo then. 
how am I down on time when they started later? That's weird. That's weird. Oh, lost my night there, you know. Lost my night. My position's all to pop. Lost my night, lost my queen, everything. Wow, dear me. Losing pawns left, right and centre. Is this not working out? Let's attack the bishop. Got a two on one here. Maybe, can we make it a three on one? Don't think we'll have time. It's just going to push down, isn't it? Okay, let's see if we can, but it's just going to push down so we can bring the knight back. Okay, so they've got a bit of cleverness. They started really slow in, and now they're moving real fast. So I've got question marks on this game already. Okay, so I'll just move here, attacking the pawn. Let's get it into the game a bit. Got space here as well. Let's move it. Got space here for this night. Okay, what's the magic now? We we'll take here on the rook. We've got one, two, three, three pieces on there. He's got two pieces defending when he moves this rook out of the way. Okay, so I'll take with the knight first, with the fork and both of these things, situations. Bishop takes, rook takes, rook takes. Uh, yep, yeah, okay, let's take. Okay, so we're going to capture back, obviously. Has he got a fork with his knight? Okay, right, so we're... Now this is, I don't want to lose too much time here. Let's we can come and put a check and win the pawn. Or not, because his rook can just come here. Hmm. <laughs> okay, let's go here. So he's looking to clock up some time. Let's go here. Night, 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 nights. Come on. Let's get the bishop off. Okay, that was a nice, interesting game there. I think one of the one of the main things for me um, for chess is <clears throat> if you're going to get put off by losing a game of chess, then really chess really isn't the game for you. If you can't take losing to then benefit from that loss and you know really develop going forward, then chess isn't the game for you. Learning to accept losses and and really de-stress yourself from 
the winning mentality in a sense and say well okay I'm here I'm participating am I developing can I take something away from this situation and as you're getting better and better you'll start seeing more, more things within your games and you'll really enjoy them but if you're really taking it too serious you're going to be so disappointed when you do lose and that's where you're going to give yourself a stress headache okay some more bullet let's just push through the center here just, uh, okay let's just do what we're doing which is just blocking off the fried liver attack and they're attacking let's just castle keeping it all simple it's looking like keeping attention okay well we could take pawn takes go and attack his bishop but I'm just going to open up the our white square bishop he does take let's grab let's attack the bishop let's take long pause okay so I'll give him a bit of space here let's grab this here push on to this palm it's just uh, making his way around let's go here so let's attack this palm head of the snake obviously it's not going to take is it oh surprise surprise I'm really shocked at that okay so we'll grab let's push on to his bishop and uh, let's attack the bishop open up the rook or the pawn is taking so let's shall we grab it yeah and let's uh, yes champion in this pawn mm. okay all right don't lose too much um let's go here Queen's looking for a bit of fun on this pawn. Boom, boom, boom. It's going to get a two on one into with the rook. Yeah, his rook's coming here. So we're ahead on time, positionally not too strong. I don't know. So he can come here. He's not doing that. Mm -mm -mm. So tempting, but uh, can't even go here. See if he wants to exchange the queen off because he's not doubled yet on here. Or does he go back just for the rook? So he's probably looking for a draw then if he does that. He's hiding, so he's going to go backwards and forwards, isn't he? Mm, let's take. Come back here, Queen's putting a check on, yep. Gets the pawn. Ooh. Let's go here. Got a nice diamond shape there, and this doubled pawns that might be his strength. Actually, he's got a pawn majority on that side. We've got a pawn majority in the center, but it's all. Ooh. Uh, I think it's time then, isn't it? Does it just keep putting checks on me? Yeah, it's just going to keep putting checks on. Oh, he's gone for it. He's risked it. He's risked. Oh, it's not a draw, is it? Oh, 
look up. Right. Okay, let's go. That was the opponent's fault. He could have just gone for a draw. He's messed it up now. Well, that's a shame. Yeah, they could have gone for a tighter draw of some sort, but they went for went for the win.